Hello Rage Fire, it's Byron here. We're gonna do a quick guide on melee and magic and ranged and how to get started. First you come to the melee store, you trade him, buy your equipment from any shop, same thing with ranged or magic, then you leave the shop, go to your teleports, monsters, beginner training. You go to the new zones, which is just snakes, or you can go to the old training zones, which is rock crabs and uh, lizards, I believe. Yes, those are men, and you just kill them. And that's how you train. That's it. All right, hello, Ragefire. So after you're done killing some monsters, you get some bones, or you can use your starter bones that you get, which should be 100 dragon bones. You get them and we're gonna go back to home and use them on the altar to train prayer and we're gonna go do that now you go home then you run over here to the church and then right click use and then you should start to use them takes a few seconds and that's how you train prayer there she is there it is, prayers going up. Alright, that's it. Hello Ragefire, we're going to do a quick tutorial on how to do Slayer on this server. So you go to Curdell and you get Task and Slayer Gem. I already have a task, it's Frost Dragons. So then you right click the gem, hit go to Task, and it should teleport you. Now if you have a task that's in the wild, it will tell you that as well. It'll say, it'll warn you. It'll say, this task is in the wild, do you sure you want to go? and then that's it you go and kill your monster and you get slayer experience and then you go back and you can reset it or you can get easier tasks for what you need and after you get 90 slayer you can do extreme tasks which give you 30 points each task but they can be they will most likely be boss tasks all right goodbye hello rage fire we're going to do a quick uh video on summoning and this is going to be the last video the last skill on this video it's all combat related stuff so what you do is you go to your magic book you go to skilling and you click next page a few times and you go to summoning and that's what gets you here you have a bank here you have the obelisk and you have the people that sell the items that make your pouches I usually start with wolf bones I usually get a few full inventories of them and then um, come over to the obelisk and I make the wolves now what you can also do is once you're done making a full inventory of wolves you get to your whatever level it may be and then you can click on pouches and it'll tell you what level you need and what you need inside to make them and that's how you get to 99 and then it'll also tell you what charms you need that's it right there and then you make them and you're gonna need all of your charms your spirit your spirit shards and your pouches and money of course to buy the items from the shop Alright, that's it. I hope you liked the video and please subscribe and join us at Ragefire.